Hello everyone, myself Sandhya Palmu. In this video, I will explain how to solve fuzzy equation. Type first a plus x equal to b. Type two a into x equal to b. Type first for a given fuzzy number a and b to solve a plus x equal to b. Step number one: find alpha cut a and alpha cut b. Step number two: use decomposition theorem, which is given as alpha cut a plus x equal to alpha cut a plus alpha cut x. Let alpha cut a equal to suppose this is in general alpha a one comma alpha a two and alpha cut b equal to alpha b one comma alpha b two and let alpha x equal to x one comma x two. A plus x equal to b. Taking alpha cut on both side, we get alpha cut a plus alpha cut x equal to alpha cut b. So alpha cut x is equal to alpha cut b minus alpha cut a. Substitute here alpha cut b minus alpha cut a. Thus, by using the subtraction of closed interval, we get alpha b one minus alpha a two comma alpha b two minus alpha a one. Suppose this first value is x one and the second value is x two. We will check this x one is less than or equal to not. If this condition fulfills, then there exists a solution. Step number three: find membership function. Example: the membership function of two fuzzy numbers a and b are a of x equal to x minus one for the range one to two, a of x equal to three minus x for the range two to three, and equal to zero otherwise. Similarly, b of x is defined as x minus thirteen upon twenty seven for the range thirteen to forty, sixty minus x divided by twenty for the range forty to sixty, and equal to zero otherwise. Solve a plus x equal to b. Here we have to find the solution that is capital X. Solution by using definition of alpha cut a, we can easily get alpha cut equal to alpha plus one three minus alpha. For all alpha belongs to zero one. Similarly, alpha cut b equal to twenty seven alpha plus thirteen comma sixty minus twenty alpha. For all alpha belongs to zero one. Let alpha cut x equal to x one comma x two. Here a plus x equal to b. Taking alpha cut on both side, we get alpha a plus x equal to alpha cut b. So alpha cut a plus alpha cut x equal to alpha cut b by using decomposition theorem. In the LHS, we get this term. So alpha x equal to alpha cut b minus alpha cut a. Substitute here alpha cut b minus alpha cut a. Thus, which is equal to x one comma x two. By using the subtraction of two closed interval, we get twenty eight alpha plus ten comma fifty nine minus twenty one alpha. Now we have to check this condition: x one is less than or equal to x two or not. So prepare this table. For particular value of some value of alpha, take suppose point one. Substitute in this first value twenty eight alpha plus ten. We get this twelve point eight. In x two, put alpha equal to point one. We get this number. Similarly, you can substitute alpha equal to point seven or point five. Here I substitute here point six and point eight. Thus, from this table, we observe that these values are less compared to this value. So this condition is fulfills. Thus, x one less than equal to x two. Hence, solution exists. Now we will follow the step number three. Let twenty eight alpha plus ten equal to x. So find alpha in terms of x. As alpha belongs to semi open interval zero to one, put alpha equal to zero. We get x equal to ten. Put alpha equal to one. We get x equal to thirty eight. Thus, solution is capital X of x equal to x minus ten divided by twenty eight for the range ten to thirty eight. Now let fifty nine minus twenty one alpha equal to x. Find alpha in terms of x as alpha belongs to semi open interval zero to one. When alpha equal to zero, this x equal to fifty nine. When alpha equal to one, x equal to thirty eight. Thus, finally, we get x of x equal to this first term. For the range ten to thirty eight, the second value for the range thirty eight to fifty nine, and it is equal to zero. Otherwise, this is the solution for the equation a plus x equal to b. Second example: 
the membership function of two fuzzy numbers a and b are given as below a of x is defined x minus 3 for the range 3 to 4 5 minus 6 for the range 4 to 5 and it is equal to 0 otherwise similarly b of x is x minus 12 by 8 for the range 12 to 20 32 minus 6 by 12 for the range 20 to 32 and it is equal to 0 for otherwise solve a into x equal to b here we have to find the solution that is find the value for capital x solution by using definition of alpha cut we get alpha cut equal to alpha plus 3 comma 5 minus alpha for all alpha belongs to semi open interval 0 to 1 alpha cut b equal to 8 alpha plus 30 plus 12 comma 32 minus 12 alpha for all alpha belongs to semi open interval 0 to 1 let alpha x equal to x1 comma x2 ax equal to b taking alpha cut on both sides and by using decomposition theorem we can write alpha cut a into alpha cut x equal to alpha cut b so alpha x equal to alpha cut b upon alpha cut a substitute here alpha cut b in the numerator alpha cut a is in the denominator now we will check this x1 less than or equal to x2 or not prepare a table and take some values for alpha as 0 0.3 0 0.7 0 0.9 thus we get these are the values and which is comparatively less to this x2 so we can write x1 less than or equal to x2 hence solution exists let 8 alpha plus 12 divided by alpha plus 3 equal to x so this numerator keep as it is multiply this x alpha x plus 3x try to write down alpha in terms of x as alpha belongs to semi open interval 0 to 1 so put alpha equal to 0 we get x equal to 4 when alpha equal to 1 we get x equal to 5 thus we get capital x which is the equa which is the value for the range 4 to 5 similarly for the second value 32 minus 12 alpha upon 5 minus alpha write down alpha in terms of x and substitute alpha equal to 0 we get x equal to 6.4 when alpha equal to 1 we get x equal to 5 so this is the solution for the range 5 to 6.4 thus x of x is for the range 4 to 5 this is the so this is the equation for membership function and for the range 5 to 6.4 this is the membership function and it is equal to 0 otherwise thank you